Code and its parent company, PS, is an organization that helps others build better software. We do so in a variety of ways, whether that is uh, custom software, whether that is consulting, whether that's training and mentoring, to the magazine we publish, to events we're involved with. Everything we do revolves around this basic idea of helping people with their software projects. What's unique about Code is our position in the industry. Uh, we are consulting a custom software company, but we also do a lot of training. We have a lot of involvement in various community efforts, ranging from small community events such as user groups all the way up to major conferences and the largest events in the industry. Uh, we are, of course, the publisher of the magazine and thus have a lot of access to a wide list or a wide range of authors. We are involved in a variety of insider groups. I myself am a Microsoft regional director, so I have access to the RD network. We have more Microsoft MVPs than any other companies so with access to those networks. We are involved in strategic design reviews. And all these uh, different things combined put us in a very, very interesting position where we have access to a lot of different people like authors. Uh, so while we don't claim to be the best at everything, uh, we do have access to people that are not just good at what they do, but that are the best and the world's leading experts at their individual fields. And that, of course, is an advantage we can pass on to our customers. Code covers a wide range of technologies in order to satisfy the needs of a modern business application and business systems. That includes, of course, various web platforms, whether it's a web app or a website. It includes cloud platforms, it includes on-premise. We also, and this is somewhat unique, build advanced Windows desktop applications. And of course, we cover the whole mobile range, covering all the mobile operating systems and the mobile devices. Code Framework is our framework for building business applications. It's something that we originally developed in-house. We then made it available to anyone who's interested. It's completely free, open source. Anyone can download it, anyone can use it, even without our involvement. But we use it for most or, or many of our projects, although it's an optional component, of course. And the goal of Code Framework is to help people build advanced business applications more efficiently faster, yet at the same time build applications that are very, very flexible, whether that is an, a very advanced Windows app, whether that's an advanced service setup, whether that's an advanced web application or even mobile, uh, you have these code framework components that can be used or extended or some people just use small elements of it. There's no strings attached, we never charge for it, but it certainly does help us in building applications more efficiently and at a very high level of quality and sophistication. Code Staffing, as the name implies, is a service that provides strategic staff augmentation and as such we provide people that can work alongside your own team, provide experience and expertise and also manpower that you may need. But what's unique about it is that the people we provide through this service are not just the individuals, but they are people that have access to everything we do as code and as such they get trained by us. They have access to all our resources, all our experts through the various networks. And as such, when you get a person through code staffing, you really gain access to all the resources and all the knowledge code has to offer. Code Magazine is our publication for professional software developers. It's available in print. It's also available digital and online. It covers a wide range of topics of interest for professional business application developers. It is written by a wide range of authors from all kinds of companies, our own, as well as other companies, including Microsoft and many others. And what makes it unique, we feel, is that it covers topics that are significant to developers today. So it's a little bit forward-looking, but we are always aiming to provide topics that are important to developers either today or for the decisions they make today.